This is the uh, Emacs Tiny Hawk drone. I got it a couple days ago and I'm <clears throat> going to do a review and uh, some setup information on it, some of the things that I've learned. But one of the things that I realized when I first started to fly it in the angle mode in the house is that it was drifting every which way from Sunday. So being that it is an F4 controller with beta flight, uh, it dawned on me that maybe the accelerometer wasn't calibrated correctly. So uh, I went in and uh, noticed that it was way off. But in order to really correctly calibrate the accelerometer, you need to have the drone sitting perfectly, perfectly level. So what I did was I found a drinking glass with it where the opening size fit right down inside the motor prop hubs uh, exactly. So like that. And then I took a level because none of the furniture or anything is generally perfectly level. And I used some post-it notes to exactly level the glass in two directions, like this. And uh, once I knew that I had the glass perfectly level, uh, I could uh, then plug the drone into the computer and uh, set the accelerometer, and I'll show you how in a second. Okay, once I was certain that the glass was level, I take the drone, make sure I get the right US, micro USB connector, and plug the, the computer into the drone, which uh, fires it up. And then I'm going to take the drone and set it right on the drinking glass, making sure that the cable isn't lifting any of the uh, any of the corners, moving it in any which way. So the drone, now based on the fact that the glass is level, is uh, sitting perfectly level. Okay, then we'll go into the computer, open beta flight, and I'm not bothered with screen recording. I'm just uh, showing you this uh, right on the computer screen and connect the drone to beta flight. Now, you'll notice that uh, the drone looks pretty level already. That's because I already calibrated the uh, this thing and it works great. So up here in the upper left-hand corner is a button that says calibrate accelerometer. When I first put this thing in, uh, and I'll move over here and move the drone, it was showing like that. And uh, that's what the drone thought was level. So putting it back on the level table and pressing the, the button once, it says calibrating and uh, it sets the pitch and roll to zero degrees and that uh, will make your drone not drift in, in any direction. Now there's nothing you have to save after you calibrate the accelerometer. You basically just have to disconnect the drone from Betaflight and you're all done. And that was simple. So if you've got one of these Emax Tiny Hawks and you have a problem where you think you have to use the trim controls on your transmitter to keep it from going forwards or backwards or sideways in the stabilized mode. Uh, this is a simple fix for that and it works great. So thanks for watching and uh, stay tuned. I'm going to do a complete review after I've spent about a week with this little thing uh, and go over uh, all of the Betaflight uh, tuning that I've done to make it uh, a much better flyer, especially in the stabilized mode uh, in the house. So thanks for watching. See you next time.
Bum, 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 bum.